Hi, Professor Lobot. Um, another great week at the internship. Um, <clears throat> the snow did not stop us this week, um, or the ice, I guess. We had a group, an engineering group, staying at the hotel. So we, and me and Kendall, got to work a couple events with them. Unfortunately, the restaurant was closed, but the events still went on. Um, so we had a mixology class on Wednesday, which was actually very exciting. I really, I enjoyed myself um, a lot more than I thought I was going to. Kevin um, made three drinks with the engineering group that was staying at the hotel. And they had a few team bonding activities and one of them was making a bunch of mixed drinks, which that's my kind of bonding activity. <laughs> um, so he made a espresso martini he made a um, gin fizz, and then he also made with them a um, not tequila, tequila sunrise, which is supposed to be a non-alcoholic drink, but they added alcohol to it. So, um, yeah, so he walked through those um, with them, and then me and Kendall were there to assist him, and also uh, we did set up for the event um, so everyone kind of got their own bottle of gin or tequila, and then they had ice buckets on their table, um, and then they also all had their own shakers. So in between each drink, me and Kendall were really quickly going and washing those out, um, and then bringing them back so they could make the other drink. The, ex the espresso martini was a little messy. They're, they used heavy whipping cream in the, in the shakers, and so that kind of got everywhere, but uh, we were quick to clean that up. Um, and the gin fizz was super interesting because it has egg whites in it, and I did not know that. Um, and then the not tequila sunrise was also really good, or I didn't try any, but um, it looked really good. And then on Wednesday, or that was on Wednesday, and then on Friday morning, um, they had a breakfast that was like before before they checked out. So I did set up and tear down with that um, with another coworker of mine, and um, that was a quicker event. It was more in and out. On Wednesday, it was a bit harder because the snowstorm had just hit. So they were only do the kitchen was closed and they only were doing pieces. They had one chef. So after the mixology class, like they had to make these. But maybe they make like 15 pizzas. And so me and Kendall and Kevin were all back there like making pizzas, which was crazy. Um, and then handing them out and just doing dishes and a little bit extra time spent there, but that's also super great to just get more experience. Um, so yeah, like I said, the Friday event was a lot quicker. Um, we just got in there, made, um, or put out the breakfast and they had eggs and, a meat and um, a sort of pastries and then bagels, coffee and tea as well. Um, and so once they were finished with that, we cleared that and then did a tear down um, because they had a baby shower on Saturday, which I did not work, but they, we still had to um, get the room cleaned up. Uh, they had been using that, the, the engineering group had been using that event space for a couple days, so it was a little dirty. Um, and we definitely don't want to just leave it like that, of course. Um, this next week will be a lot lighter um, in work. There's not any events coming up until the following week. Um, so it'll mostly just be restaurant service and, um, and back waiting, which will be really good. Um, to get back to that um yeah so I'm very excited for that I would say the number one thing that I learned this past week was you know you don't really know how what you're going to be doing that day but you need to have the attitude to just step up and um f put on whatever shoes that you need to put on that day you know whether it be if you're gonna, I mean, on Wednesday, we had to step in and start cooking things. So, you know, you gotta you gotta change out those hats that you might wear. Um, but it was good to get that experience back there. I can add line cook um, to my <laughs> resume now. 
Um, but yeah, excited for this next week and hope you had a good few snow days. Thank you.